Howdy folks and welcome to Hawkmer Outdoors. And on this episode, got another unboxing dupe, the Bear Creek Arsenal Bufferless 9mm. So, y'all stay tuned. unboxing the Bear Creek Arsenal bufferless 9mm pistol. Now I spent my own hard earned money on this gun. Bear Creek sent us rifles in the past but this is one that I actually bought. Got the owner's manual. They shipped that same owner's manual with all their other guns. Of course the Screaming Bear sticker. Gotta have it. They sent a bicycle lock for some reason. I don't haven't rode a bicycle in a while. Um, but anyways, the bell of the ball, the bufferless 9mm pistol. It is clear. I went with the 4 inch barrel, 4.5 inch barrel, because I think it looks the coolest. Um, buddy, it handles pretty nice. So that's what you get with your bufferless 9mm pistol. Go with some of the features of this uh, bufferless 9mm here does feature the spiral brake on the front, 4 inch barrel, nice free float hand guard with 3 m lock slots on it, nice uh, monolithic Pekingese rail on the top there, can use uh, Glock 9mm mags, and it is a side charger, I guess they have different varieties of that, uh, standard uh, AR-15 grip there, it also has on the back here a nice Pekingese rail on the back to attach uh, braces or other things that you uh, so desire, but that is the features of the 9mm pistol here. Here's the best part of an unboxing video is the first shots. I haven't shot this gun at all, haven't taken it apart, so we'll see uh, this is exactly how you get it. Didn't lock back, but she did run through all 10 rounds there. Very nice. Got a garbage bag loaded up here. 10 rounds, different variety. Hollow points, steel, brass. Just a little test we do here on Hawkmire Outdoors. Give her a go. Everything. Bear Creek Bufferless 9mm was tried some different mags. We got the big boy, the 33 rounder. Moving down, we got the 17, 17 rounder. Moving further down, we got the 19 size. This is the ETS mag. And my favorite, moving further down, we have the 10 round 26 size. Handles them all. All your double stack 9mm mags will fit in this guy. I bought this bufferless 9 with my own money. This actually came from a walnut money. If you watched our walnut video, this is the product of that hard labor. So I'm pretty proud of it. Um, I feel accomplished. <laughs> but I bought this because I thought it looked really cool. It was something new Bear Creek had to offer. And so far, I've really liked Bear Creek's products, like their customer service, everything about it. What I want to do with this, this is going to become Project Build-A-Bear Creek. So, there's going to be a lot of modifications going on to this weapon. And you'll see it here on Hawkmire Outdoors. We'll do random updates and show you the progression of this little build. So, be on the lookout for it. It's Project Build-A-Bear Creek. Overall, 
Great little pistol, the 9mm bufferless has passed all the Hawkmire outdoor tests. Um, just a couple little critiques. We do wish that the screw in the back for this uh, plate on the back was the same as the uh, charging handle screw. They seem to be a different one. You know, don't know the science behind it, but they probably did a little bit of beefier uh, screw on the back, but you know, it could be the same. Any critiques there? Really one of my biggest critiques is it didn't ship with a mag, which isn't a big deal for me. I have plenty of Glock mags laying around, and as we showed you, it'll take the big 33 round fun sticks all the way down to the small 26 size mags, which is kind of nice. It gives it a nice low profile. But it'd be nice if they shipped with at least one mag. Um, some people might not have Glock mags laying around. The only other critique, make this thing in 10 millimeter. Bear Creek, if you're watching this, yes. and I know you have watched our videos, if you can make the same gun in 10 millimeter, game changer. Hot That'd cakes. Be, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Everybody's wanting a 10 millimeter. Hawkmire Outdoors included. Yes. We take this thing deer hunting, mm -hmm. all all sorts of fun stuff, but. Yeah, that's so far, the first 50 rounds through the gun. That's really the only critiques we can come up with. Thanks for watching today's video, and be sure to keep an eye on our channel when we have updates on Project Build-A-Bear Creek. <laughs> Very nice pistol. Go check it out at Bear Creek Arsenal. But if you want a 308 450 Bushmaster or 22 Mag, and you want 5% off that, uh, type in the code Hawkmire at Bear Creek Arsenal. Go check it out. Pick yourself up one. But thanks for everything that you do. And you all have a good one.